Brethren and friends, it doesn't matter what you're going through. Give God thanks. Because He is still looking out for us. Praise God. It doesn't matter what. Sometimes it's hard. Sometimes, you know, we are so burdened down. But still give God thanks. Praise the Lord. I just want to encourage you that we're the last of the trying days when we ought to make our calling and election sure. This is a time when we know that salvation is personal. It is personal in this time and age. We can't look at the pastor. We can't look at the bishop. We can't look at the brethren. We have to look to God. And if we can't inculcate that within us, that salvation is personal, then we are going to lose out. You know, one man, he wanted something from the man of God. We know of the story of Elisha and Elijah. Praise God. And we, this time, we want something. And it is eternal life. Elijah, he journeyed amidst the discouragement that he was given. Don't you know your master will be taken away? You know, Elisha, he wanted something from Elijah. And he said, you know, amidst the discouragement, hold your peace. Hold your peace. So if it is trials, tell it to hold his peace.
missionaries, all the saints in Christ, you know, I've sent their greetings for the church. But I'm just saying this to say that in spite of my storm, I'm going to worship my God. In spite of my tribulation, I'm going to worship my God.
Was just more than a man. 